Mosaic was um, something that I saw as a kid, and I saw it and I said, wow, that is something else. If there's anything I could do, um, it would be that. But it was sort of a whimsical dream at that stage. I went to Bali with my family and was really inspired by the Hindu people, uh, the way they adorn their buildings, it's just so beautiful. When I did start, I was quite naive. I was basically just breaking tiles and cutting them and doing crazy paid pieces. And then I went to an international conference in Melbourne and discovered this wonderful material, smalty, which is hand chiseled glass and working it with hammers instead of with cutters and chiseling things and getting um, different faceting, you know, it was a textural sort of thing rather than just the surface. My whole world really opened up. It's about manipulating the material in a way that gives it the most amount of beauty. It is a thing about beauty uh, for me. You can have 10 people make a mosaic the same image and you get 10 different looking mosaics. There's something of personality that's transposed into the work. It's pretty much the Italians that like to think that they're the owners of mosaic. Um, but the beauty of here in Australia is that we're so informal and we're sort of anyone can have a go because it's a concrete thing and you get to touch and feel it and it's not like you're on the end of a brush or mixing with colour, uh, it's not flat, you know, it is heavy, it lasts, you can put it out in the weather, uh, that's, that's definitely an added bonus. The work's still going to be there maybe in a thousand years time.